oxycore. I just want to send another message out to the dudes that shot me. I'm still here. All five bullets touched me, but you couldn't kill me. So all you did was really just give me that much more ambition, that much more uh, drive to go forward. You really won't be able to stop me because I'm gonna be unstoppable because my heart is strong, my drive is strong. I mean, I feel like God put his hands on me. So thanks to everybody that supported me, for the dudes that shot me. Thanks, but no thanks. I'm still alive, you miss. Ha <laughs> ha, I'm hard to kill, blah, blah. Nah, nah, nah. OCO, thank y'all for tuning in to another requested video. As I always like to express in all my other videos, I am not here to turn non believers into believers. I'm only here to bring y'all food for thought. And with that being said, your opinion is your opinion. Get right down to it. All right, y'all. So, from this video, we can obviously see that Pop wasn't really worried about nobody. Not only that, what if I told you that Pop is still living and he's still an MC rapper? It's very crazy how a lot of people don't believe me, but a lot of people must have forgotten what his own manager who was shook said he did say that he could be posted up somewhere with his feet up cooling bigger back bowling just chilling smoking a little cuban cigar or something y'all let me know what y'all think not only that do y'all believe also that the reason Pac called himself machiavelli is because he wanted to let us know that he was going to fake his death also do y'all believe quincy jones sent out them people to make sure that Pac couldn't speak no more due to the fact that quincy jones asked Pac to do some things that he may was not ruling wanting to do y'all let me know what y'all think also do y'all think that Pac walked past himself that day at the mgm studio because we do know that the pot that we seen in the car is not the original Pac due to the fact that the tattoos was off so y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments and like always if you're function with me on a monthly daily weekly basis y'all already understand that clear eyes always recognize real lies and like always i'm always gonna have more videos until next time that way that part why though saying tupac coming back this year uh i've been fucking here you just recognizing the shit and stuff you know so yeah michael and i also want to acknowledge uh... i mean this dude is a genius